A submarine has a sleek cigar-shaped body that enables it to move swiftly underwater. A pressure hull made of high-strength metal contains the submarine's crew, machinery, and most or all weapons, preventing them from being crushed by the pressure of the water at deep depth. A submarine has tanks built into the bow and stern called the main ballast tanks. The sections of the bow and stern containing the tanks are not usually surrounded by a pressure hull. In order for the submarine to dive, the main ballast tanks are flooded with seawater. The added weight causes the ship to lose its ability to stay on the surface of the water and it submerges. Movable surfaces on the outside of the submarine control its movement beneath the water. These surfaces are horizontal diving planes and vertical rudders at the stern and a forward set of diving planes either on the bow or on the sail structure. To dive, the diving planes at the stern are tilted down. As the submarine is propelled forward, the flow of water over the tilted planes causes the submarine to glide downward. The rudders steer the ship. Crewmen can turn a rudder to the left or right to make the submarine change course. To move the submarine upward, the stern diving planes are angled up. The diving planes at the bow or sail are used to help keep the submarine at a precise depth while near the surface, especially when launching missiles or when raising an antenna or periscope above the surface. To resurface, water is blown out of the ballast tanks by compressed air so that the submarine comes up through the water.